Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Morris Mano and Michael Siliti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 3.3 .3 from chapter number 3. Okay, so the problem is simplify the following boolean expressions using three variable maps. We are given four expressions. Okay, we are given four boolean expressions and we have to use three variable maps to simplify or minimize these expressions so the first problem is this one second problem is this one okay so i am separating it with a line here in the first problem we have x y plus x bar y bar z bar plus x bar y z bar here you can see that this whole row has x equal to 1 okay similarly we have to find out y is 1 for these two columns okay y is 1 here, y is 1 here. Similarly, z is 1 here and z is 1 here. So, z is 1 for here. And for this column and this column, z is 0. Okay. So, similarly, we will put the values here. First of all, we have x, y. Here, you can see that x is y. Here, you have to understand that if there is a complement, okay, we will consider it to be 0 here in these values. Okay. 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. If there is 0, that means this y value is 0 here and z value is 0 here. Okay, so similarly, we will consider it here. x, y. x is 1, y is 1. Here in this row, x is 1. And for these two column, y is 1. So we have to put 1 values for these two column and these two and this row common boxes. Okay, so we will put here x, y. I am explaining once again. That means x, y. x is 1, y is 1. So here we can see that x is 1 for this complete row and y is 1 for these two columns. Okay. That means these four boxes. So for this row and these two columns, the common boxes are these two. Okay. So we'll put here 1. Let us go to the second term. We have x bar, y bar, z bar x bar is this line x is 0 here because x bar is this line so this line you take it okay then y bar y bar means these two the, here y is 1 so these two row okay so we got these two common column and then we have z bar z is 1 so we can only put 1 here okay then we have x bar y z bar okay x bar is this line y is these two column and z bar z for from these two common column we will have to find out z bar column okay so we'll get this box z equal to zero therefore we'll put one here so we can combine like this okay all the other values are zero okay so from this term we can write it as x and y z is zero okay x y Plus, from this combination, we will get this whole line is x bar. So, x bar and y is cancelled because 0 and 1 and z bar. Okay, z bar. So, this is the simplified Boolean expression. Previously, it was this. Okay, after simplification, we got this one x y plus x bar z bar. And similarly, we will find out the simplified expression for the second problem. So, the, for the second problem, we have x bar y bar see x bar is this line y bar okay y bar is these two columns so we'll put here one and one then we have yz y is this one y is one z is one that means we have to find out the common columns okay for y is one and z is one only these two boxes have y equal to one and z equal to one so we'll put here one and one and similarly for the third term we have x bar y z bar so x bar is this line y bar is these two column and z bar from z bar we can see that this this column has z bar okay so already we have written one okay so need not to write again now we can combine like this 0 0 0 okay so from this term we will get x bar and y bar plus from this term we will get y bar y z y z okay so this is the solution of the second part okay now let us solve the third part of the problem In the third section of the problem we have x bar y see x bar is this line okay this row x bar y and now see the y 
Y is one here, okay. So one and one. Then Y Z bar. Y is this two column. Y value is one and Z bar. Z bar is this one. This one column only. Okay. So we'll get here one. And Y bar Z bar. Y bar is this two column. Okay. And Z bar is this column. Okay. So we'll get one here. Okay. Oh, we have to put one again one here. So we can combine like this. I made a mistake previously. Okay. We combine like this and this one another term. Okay. So from this term we get x equal to 0. So x bar and y. Plus for this term. Okay. We will get x equal to x will be cancelled and y is 0 and 1. Y is also cancelled and z bar x bar y plus z bar so this is the solution of the third part of the problem again we have x y z x value is one here y value is one here so these two column and z is one here okay so one value here then we have x bar y bar z x bar is this row y bar is these two column okay we got the these two and z so z is one here so put one here and for the third term we get x y bar z bar x is one here okay y bar z bar y bar is these two column okay we got these two value and z bar z bar means here so we can take like this okay we cannot minimize it anymore okay so we cannot minimize anymore so the terms will be the same okay for this term we will get x y bar z bar plus for this time we get x bar y bar z plus for this time we get x y z it is the similar term okay thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you